What's up guys, welcome back to today. We're going to be drawing John Cena. I'm on a landscape page, use a pencil eraser, hit pause if I go too fast. Head is in the top half of my page, right? Just wanted to fit in like some of his muscles and like his strap that's on his arm. So let's go. Center point of my page about here. We'll come up over to the right hand side and start with his eyes. Very small eyes, right? So we go diagonal. And then it comes down. Like so. Downturn slightly. And there's like some eyelashes down here. Just a little bit. Bottom eyelid line. So we got like his tear duct kind of in here. And then the bottom eyelid comes around like so. His iris then inside there. So just this circle just inside with the top and bottom sort of cut off by his eyelids. And then the pupil. And then the little relatively small. Okay, and then we can just see a line for the tear duct. And then we have an eyelid line just coming out the top here. And at the bottom as well. That comes down and then like curves around his, like the corner of his eye here. So we could have some eyelashes on the bottom. It's just these little dots and dashes just coming around the bottom of his eye. Like so. We can see his eyebrow, right? He's got this like big forehead, right? So we can just see like a curved line going this way. And then his eyebrow goes like just across this and it kind of disappears underneath his hat, but we can draw in most of what we can see anyway. It just comes across like so, and maybe like just down the side here. And some of this is underneath his hat, right? So we'll have to erase it, but we'll draw what in what we can see anyway. Right, like so. And then, He's got like an eyelid line just coming under here. So then measure the width of his eye, come over that distance, and then you start the next eye in a similar fashion. So you just go diagonal up, and then it goes down. All right, and then the bottom eyelid again. Up into the tear duct. Little tear duct just there. And then the iris circle, just the sides of it we can see. And the pupil in the center. And then top eyelid there. And then you can see a little bit of the bottom eyelid coming off back here. And it just goes around there at the corners of his eye. And then dots and dashes for the bottom eyelashes. And then some bags just underneath his eye. Eyebrow again, same thing, goes underneath his um, his hat, but we'll draw it in. Quite square, sort of eyebrows. So a lot of it kind of disappears behind his hat, but we'll just draw in a bit of it anyway. <laughs> Right, and then his nose. So he's got like a real wide nose, right? So 
let's say so the bridge of the nose kind of goes down this way first right kind of bumps out a little bit like so and then we'd like to skip a bit and just go for nostrils so just these lines like so and then they're joined together in the center so it kind of just curves around and then we will darken up the nostrils just to make them look like they go in but they're holes and then we got like some some of the nostrils the skin on the side of the nostrils curves around like so some like hatching lines just on the side of his nose there and then the bridge of the nose kind of like sticks out quite far here okay kind of like so right then his mouth so he's kind of smiling kind of but looks a bit serious as well so let's see curves up on the corners right and we're underneath his pupil right where it curves and then we go over there's the center line for his lips now down and up again underneath the pupil okay and then the top lip line just on top up down in the middle back up down to there right so it's like a stretched out letter m sort of for his top lip All right and then the bottom lip down across just there and maybe like a shadow just underneath here on the line maybe for his chin so he has like a real strong sort of chin right so it's kind of like one of these kind of chins. And then, so his chin and his jaw, right? So real square sort of chin, right? Kind of curves up in the middle, down again, back up here. And then the jaw kind of sticks out the side going this way. Right, so a bit tricky now. Okay. Proportions of things, right? His head is kind of tilted back, or, or so. So you've got like eyebrows to the bottom of the nose would be about the same as bottom of the nose to the chin. So you're like this whole space, top of the eyebrow, bottom of the nose is the same as bottom of the nose to the chin, and then bottom of the nose to the bottom lip is about the same as bottom lip to chin. Okay. So that's the proportion you're dealing with, right? And then his jaw is real square. So it goes like up this way first. Like that, right? And you've got this cheekbone that kind of comes in, right? So it goes, goes in a bit and out. And just up towards his hat, right? So this is like the cheekbone that kind of goes down into there okay and you do the same thing on this side it kind of curves out up and this is like his bone of his cheek that kind of comes down here and then we've got like these lines that go down the side of his mouth just these light sort of lines there <laughs> And then that top lip sort of line. Okay. Like so, right? 
right and then his ears stick out from from here right so just like he's got like cauliflower well no he doesn't have too bad cauliflower ear actually curves out around and up into his jaw okay and here as well like so Right, and then lines inside, so a little bit. Like this. He's got a bit of cauliflower ear on this side. More so. Right? And then, so his hat, right? So like I said, it, it goes over his eyebrows a little bit, but first we got like the top of it, right? So it like goes this way. Right, and then the, the peak is kind of real bent in, right? So it's like curved. Comes around over the eyebrow first. So like same sort of level, so we'll go here. Right, and then it curves up and over like a, like a bridge down to there, and then this has like an edge to it, so up and around like so. And then the, the rest of the hat, so it goes all up to a sort of a point in the middle, and then down. The other side, like so. And then we have a white section here in the center. And then we have a stitching running like seems up the middle like that and then stitching all around here okay and then so this is like his brow as well so he's got like a heavy sort of brow And he's just, he, you can't see any hair because his head is shaved. Right, so then the neck. Crazy muscly dude, right? So his neck comes right down from his ear nearly. Coming down this way. Okay. And then we have like neck muscles coming down here. Adam's apple, like that. All right, and then big traps. So big trapezius muscles just here. And going out this way. So like a man's shoulders are usually head width out, right? So the width of his face will sort of bring you out to where his shoulder would be, right? So a shoulder like there right and then here center line for his chest just there and then the tops of his shoulders kind of come across here we have another sort of bump there tops of his chest sorry that's that and then chest muscles sort of curve around here Up into the center, and same on this side, kind of maybe a this might be a little bit bigger on this side. Okay, and then the rest of his shoulder muscles go in here, triceps there. Um, 
what else? Oh, he's got an armband on this arm, just here. Okay, so it like goes around here. And so you can just see like shoulder muscle armpit slash shoulder in there and then tricep goes off and so this is like bicep and then just like shoulder muscles deltoid muscles sometimes he can have like veins and things coming across And then nipples, one. Two, and then dog tags. So we got some hatching just on his trapezius that way. And like some lines on his arm there. Bicep. And then dog tags, right? So just standard sort of American military dog tags. And then there's a chain, right? So I'll just do sort of a simple sort of line going down that way. And coming out from this side, the back of his neck as well. some chest muscles striations just coming across and maybe some abs and ribs and stuff there right I'm just thicken up some of my edge lines now okay I think that's the best I can do John Cena I hope it was helpful thanks for watching see you in the next one bye